no wallet. And then that's your updates. Yeah, Leslie, you like the overlay? I, um... What's nice is I even fixed this up. Check this out. I can change the uh, meters. <laughs> for the... I can change the meters for the uh, condition. So let's see if we can finish this. I know, right? It's all fancy and whatnot. See, look at that. I even put like a little chat box too. So that works too. So, yeah. So I figure whenever I play games that are a 4 3, like this, the aspect ratio. Since I have all that empty space, I'll put a little chat box over there. So, don't look too bad. <laughs> I guess. I guess I am. That, I don't think I need the crank anymore. That's, that's... Ammo disc. Uh... Shotgun equipped, I believe. Yes. Alright, here we go. He ain't coming back. Oh, yeah. I forgot my bone. You oh. son of a bitch. <laughs> Well, that's not cool because I got to take care of those. Because I don't want them running around while I'm out there. Okay, it's just a quick press of a button and I can keep my. Flask. Can't remember where I put it. So. So I want to say there are very few zombies down here. guys we've got to worry about. I'm actually okay with the uh, condition, just a quick button press to update it. It's actually pretty cool. I like it.
do that. All right, Marcus. So I had been playing the original uh, PlayStation 1 Resident Evil. I'm pretty sure I told you guys that I was playing the uh, director's cut. And uh, yeah, the other day, I think it was the day before yesterday, I was just like, fuck it, I just kind of want to beat this. And I didn't bother trying to do <laughs> the good ending. So I just left, uh, I just left Chris down there, took off, Barry died. And I was dying laughing because, uh, of course, I'm playing on an emulator. And it has retro achievements. And when you finish the game like that, well, there's no there's no boss fight against the tyrant. The helicopter just lands and you leave. That's it. It's super anticlimactic. And uh, the achievement pops up and it says, what have you done? It said, got the bad ending. <laughs> and then I was like, I can't be bothered. I'm not going to bother doing the new one. Use the electron to replace the initials in alphabetical order. Okay. Art date. No. So it's B, A, I don't remember. about this part. We're not fuck around this. I do want to beat this tonight. So. Everybody's just going to have to fucking do it. Really? Well, good to know it doesn't do headshots. <laughs> On normal. I hear somebody walking. There we go. take the magnum arts. 
That's not even a question. <clears throat> But <laughs> this I remember. Hooray. Okay, that's upstairs. All right. This Linux ass software. <laughs> There's a battery up there, though. Come on. I have eight of these damn things? Okay, well, we're gonna save them. Because I'm probably gonna need it once I hit this, the, uh, like the engine room. This, I need a key. Open. I should be able to do an MO disc in here, I think. Fuck off. <laughs> you so can't tell. <laughs> I don't care about those right now. And these are way easier in this one. In the original, I can't find the first one. And I know it's supposed to be in the room, like the first uh, major room you come across, but I can't, I can't figure it out. Not yet. But I will take this. And this. I'll need those later. Go back upstairs. Not a crimson yet. Usually, you tell when you uh, can look at their hands. They have claws in their crimson. Still fine. Cerberus, Neptune, Hunters, Tyrants. And random asshole on the right. <laughs> <clears throat>
I'm gonna have to go uh, offload some stuff. You can just kill. Whoops! <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do that. I'm gonna go offload, come back, and get some shells and stuff. But I still need that ammo disc. <laughs> Because this whole section, I feel like, is easier in this one than it is in the original. Um, the original is a little bit of a maze. And the original, there's constantly zombies coming out. Because there's, like, holes in the walls and shit. And I guess that's just their little way of having a spawner, you know, for zombies. Um, but it's a lot more of a pain in the ass. That. Go grab those shells. Shells, ammo disc, come back, load the shotgun with the ammo disc, and then go do that. So I should be able to get the uh, the good ending with this one, because like I said, the ammo discs were easier in this one. <clears throat> but, like you can you can fly out see them, and then the first one I cannot find that uh, first disc. I have no idea where it is. Do that. Should I just leave that there? I'll take it. I'll go ahead and just offload it. And then we'll come back and get the ammo disc. <laughs> but at least nothing's going to bother me in here. I can just drop it in there and it just loads. <clears throat> okay. Go ahead and do that. Save my magnum. Alright, we're going to make one more trip. We'll do one more trip. I'm going to get the MO disc. I'm going to probably come back and save just so I have it. Come on. Ooh. I did say I was going to save. I better do that.
Damn it, got to put the ribbons away. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> Yeah, I know exactly where I need to go. Just I hope that dude is enough. Actually, yeah, I'll go through that path and make sure he's not a crimson. I'm just like... He is a crimson. He's no longer a crimson. <laughs> Slow. All right. <laughs> He'll probably turn into a person. Yes. Okay, so. Here you. Is there one in here or is it on the other side? I think it's on the other side. Shotgun shells. Awesome. Alright, we'll take the shells. Yeah, they're on the other side. Another battery? <laughs> so that makes it nine batteries. Thankfully, I've been doing very well as far as defense weapons. Okay, so I need one more. Uh, one more MO disc. It's in here. Yeah, it's not in here. Anyway, yeah, because I already did that. I already, already got the password and stuff. So. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. Alright, bear with me, because I do want to get this last demo disc. Um, let's see. Okay, I think it's in a different room. <clears throat> I want to say it's in um, one of the rooms with the explosions and stuff. Okay, so I am pretty sure I can move on now. I'm still fine, still got that. I heard feet. <laughs> and in the original, it's those zombies that are running around all over the place. It's those uh, that make it like half torn up ones. I will. Okay, so. Definitely gonna say right here. This is a chance that I may explode here coming up soon. Howdy. You know what, we're just gonna back up and just let him come to us and just take him out. Play it smart. He's dead. Alright, cool. Same zombie? No, that was a different one. There was two here. There was one near the elevator and one over here. Okay, so I want to say here, I'm going to go in and take a right, because I have to get a container. But I have to avoid these damn chimeras at the same time. You dead? Of course not, why would he be? Fuel may explode if it's charred. If you have advice for the pod, it's not working right now because there's no fuel, but there's an empty capsule. Okay. Damn it, I forgot to do that. Do it again. Where is he? Whoa! You son of a bitch. Trying to clear this area. Just 
gonna drop off the ribbons and grab the grenade launcher. I don't remember what side it was on. Was it over here? No, it was over here. Not in here. It's other room. All right, now the fun part. I had to clear out that area because I needed to get this fuel. But the problem is you can't run or shoot when you have this because you're, you will explode. And that's why I was trying to clear areas and stuff so I could walk it. Running could result in a fatal explosion. So we're just going to mosey on. Actually, I think a handgun will not set it off. There's one right here. Okay, yeah, that's just as good. Okay. Because we're almost done. I think another 15, 20 minutes will be there. If memory serves. <laughs> Start running again. I heard that. Come on.
All right. You rat bastard. <laughs> Can't remember if the ammo's in here or not. I'm pretty sure there is an ammo disc area here. It's right in front of me. Cool. Awesome. Okay, so once we're done here, I'll go and check the door. I'll take that. Can't have too many of these. Yeah. Just a big circle. <clears throat> so, leaving here, I'm gonna go check that ammo that door. It's like the bugs in RE4. I think they're the same ones, aren't they? I want to say they're the same ones. Oh lord, he's waddling! He's waddling! We're gonna save the fuck out of this. Do they camouflage? I don't think they do. I think in here they just rush you. I'm pretty sure in this one they just rush you. I'm always forgetting to put my ribbons back. That's the only difference. Yeah, other than that, they're the same ones. I haven't seen them camouflage in this one. I'm pretty sure they don't. Alright, so I'm gonna go check that door. That you have to do it for everyone. <laughs> it just doesn't do well. There we go. I feel like I was just doing this last week. Day after Christmas, my brother came over and uh, I beat this on easy. And he was like, "Oh, this takes me back." <laughs> Jill, Chris, you're alive. Of course, I'm alive. Jill, there's something big going down, and I don't think we're part of the equation. I have to get you out of here. Ugh, it won't open. Wait, I'll be back to get you out. Okay, no sightseeing though. I gotta go do with Wesker. I'll be back.
I'm going to take some extra grenade rounds because I want to say I do a short fight with Platinum. Right here before we go and do the final fight. Or should I just take all my guns with me? No, no, actually, I'll, I'll, um, I'll run into another area. I'll be okay, I think. But still, I'll take those two. <laughs> two health items, I'm good. All right. That's not where the elevator is. The elevator is working. Jill, Barry. Why, Barry, you asshole? At least waited up for you, you know? Let's go. Why would I? You left me in the fucking caverns. You prick. I think I'm armed enough. <laughs> God, that door sounded just like doom. Wesker! That sounded awesome. Thank you, Barry. Well, what do you know? Oh, don't blame Barry for everything. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger. If the he deception! Everything I tell him to. <sighs> Wesker. You're pathetic. Well, you shouldn't worry too much, dear. You'll be free of all this anyway. Why eliminate stars? Believe it or not, that's Umbrella's intention. <sighs> You're just a slave of Umbrella. Smart girl. But I think you misunderstand me. The things you mention are nothing. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry? <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family, you bastard. Oh! You bitch. Umbrella? Well, I used some carrots and sticks to cow him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used Barry for my personal interests. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following Umbrella's orders. What? What are you planning? I guess it's time for show and tell. What's really cool is I think this is... I want to say it's almost a shot, shot for shot you know, transition from the original game. It's just a lot more details and stuff because it's the remake. It's magnificent. For the sake of this thing. You know, I hate goodbyes. <laughs> Damn. In all honesty, that gun should have just... Barry blown from his collar neck from his collarbone <laughs> uh <off. laughs> no you're not to blame it's umbrella and wesker even if it meant my family i couldn't bear turning my back on my friends again shit god damn you wesker <laughs> damn shame if i had a grenade launcher <laughs> so the problem is I don't have the proper rounds. Like, I don't have acid rounds. I never have acid rounds when I need them. 
You want a piece of me? Shoot him, Barry. What? Premature. Yeah, that's what you want. <clears throat> Barry, no. No, Barry! Us. <laughs> you viral cultured freak. Oh, oh that's a dead end. Save is a switch in here. There it is. There we go. All right. Now I think it's time to fight the tyrant. Stop. We gotta go get Chris. Go through the entrance of the lab, save, pick up some stuff, and then we fight the time. So we should be. I forgot about these dudes. Dealing with your ass. I'm saving this ammo. And I'm heading this direction anyway, so I shouldn't even have to deal with them. So I want to say now I can get the. Now I can get a Chris. Because Barry didn't die, so. Yeah. Perfect. So, because I have all three of them, I should get the good ending. Jill. Sorry about the wait. Let's move your ass, Chris. So everything's taken care of? Well, almost. Now let's get the hell out of here. Okay. Yeah, um, I want to do a playthrough where I don't save Barry. <laughs> um, 
Because there is a trophy for like all the weapons. I don't know. I usually don't care about trophies and stuff, but certain games I kind of want to try to get as many as I can. Come on, let's go. Uh, I know, Chris. You gotta tell me twice. I'm waiting around. You're taking an immediate left. Hopefully, there's no chimeras that are gonna catch me. Nope. Awesome. See if there's anything I can mix it with. There we go. See, because now here we can load up, save, go up the ladder, and then we can launch that door that was there when we first came. Through. And I mix this with anything I can. Not. That's fine. We're taking that stuff. We're taking. I have one Asperger. Uh, we're taking that. We're gonna save. And I'm gonna dump the ribbons because if I don't, I won't be able to pick up these. So 20 saves looks like my final save count. Try it like this. If, if I die for some reason, then um, you know we can just do it again and keep the extra save. The extra what do you call it? Healing. Come on, come on, hurry! Just open the door. You made your way and then they stop. Items. This is Brad. I'm running out of fuel. If there's anyone alive, contact me now or just give me a sign. I repeat, this is your last chance. And in the original one, you actually do a signal fire. Weird ass fuse unit that's just sitting there conveniently. And it's funny because it's sitting there like that too in the original. Just, just sitting there on the floor. Three minutes to detonation. Okay. Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just get in contact with Brad! No! We can make it. Jill, ladies first. Chris! Oh, thanks, Chris. Would you let me have my moments too? No. Alright. We'll rendezvous at the heliport. Absolutely not. Three minutes. It's really more like two fifty. Yeah, I was gonna say it's more like two fifty, two forty. <laughs> Dick. 
Whoa! <laughs> Instant danger, marvelous. Oh, damn. Okay. Yeah, if he's gonna start moving like that, then I may have to uh, do this again. Oh, no. Oh, let's see. Or not. Use it. Kill it, whatever it is. Oh no! Ah, oh, damn it! Damn it! Pretty much. <laughs> Fucking figures. Okay, so I'm not even gonna bother with the self-defense gun. I'm gonna take the extra. Um. I guess I'll take the extra healing then. That turn, man, when he fucking... That was crazy. But it's fine. We're right here. Two... But all I can do. I'd rather have the grenade launcher. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Come on, come on, hurry! All I had to do was pick up that rocket launcher and shoot him once, and we would have had it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we know. Yo, asshole. <laughs> Got it. We're done. We beat it. That fucker.
Fuck that mansion. <laughs> Cool. Shit. See, I'm still. I still wish they would have made the two and three remake like this. That would have been so good. The new remakes are still good. They're just way shorter. Jill, you did a fine job. Take that, zombies. Let's see, pictures is about 87. Playtime, six and a half. Ink ribbons, 20. Yeah, that's not too bad. Because in the first one, there's no rank. It's just, you know, timing and stuff. That felt like I used way more healing items than that. <laughs> Ugh. Real survival mode unlocked. Item boxes are no longer connected, meaning that items can only be taken from the box where they were stored. Also, weapon aiming is manual. Experience these prototype only features unavailable in the original Resident Evil gameplay. Well, I used to play with aiming on manual anyway, so that's not too bad. It's that boxes not being connected that's the problem. You've got a closet key. So I got a new outfit. I I want to say that is her Resident Evil 3 outfit. I believe. Oh, zero cleared. And once again in the real survival. Wow. That was awesome and there's i don't know maybe one day i'll fuck around and i'll play the real survival mode but god that's gonna suck i can handle aiming manually that's no problem i used to play like that all the time anyway um it's the chest not being connected that's the problem <laughs> That's uh that's where the real it'll be a real problem. <laughs> All right everybody. I guess I'm going to go ahead and call it for the night. We got one more down. So, I've got the update the Twitch page with games that we beat. So, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it. I know it was like kind of impromptu, a little bit later than usual, but 
Tomorrow we should be back on schedule. I don't know what we'll do tomorrow. I might even start two. I know we have this. I'm currently playing Resident Evil 2 Remake on my own. I've really been wanting to do finish a Claire run on, re on the original, though. So, I mean, maybe we'll finish that up. I'm not sure. We'll figure it out. Um, if it isn't this and it's something else, we'll take a break from Resident Evil for a little bit. And then we'll uh, come back like we usually do. Either that or I should start playing some Diablo. I don't know. There's so much we could play. I have too much stuff to play. So, we will catch y'all next time. See y'all tomorrow. Everybody have a good night. Happy New Year. And we'll see y'all around. Bye.